Hello everyone and welcome back to another video on my channel. This week I'm showing you guys how I edit my Instagram pictures and no one has requested this video but a lot of my Instagram followers DM me saying like oh my gosh I love your feed, I love your pictures. By the way those messages make me so happy but I wanted to show you guys if you were wondering how I edit my Instagram pictures so if you enjoyed this video please give it a thumbs up also if you enjoyed this video subscribe down below and with that being said let's get on with the video so first i'm going to show you my instagram because that's kind of like the point of this video but this is my instagram feed i have like a whitish reddish theme going on and um, my username is Amanda Rose YT. I only have 442 followers, which is still a lot of people, but you guys should go follow my Instagram. It's on the screen right now, so pause the video, go follow. Thanks. So I'm going to be showing you how I turned this picture of my aloe vera plant into this, which I posted on my Instagram. And it doesn't have red in it, but I'm also like a white theme. So I'm just going to take a screenshot of that um, because it's not like the most recent picture in my camera roll and I'm going to go to VSCO cam and import it and the first thing that I'm going to do is crop it I like to post square pictures so I will just do that and do the center of the picture and okay so the filter I use is A4 but obviously this is not like with the filter it does not look like the pictures that I post on Instagram so for this specific picture I turned the exposure up all the way like look at how big of a difference that is that is insane I love exposure and I will also turn up the contrast like a tiny bit it's only needed a little bit in this picture so I only did a little bit and then I will go to saturation and turn the saturation down a little and I will go to grain and turn the grain up so once I've done that I will save it to my camera roll and I will go to facetune which I was editing a picture but okay um, I will import this picture into facetune and I will use the whitening tool to whiten my bedspread which my bedspread is already white but I need it to be like really white because that's like my theme so this like actually kind of takes a while but I'm just going to whiten the background and make sure that you can't see like what like make sure that there's no mistakes is what I'm trying to say I'm too focused on whitening this but and then I will just use this little button in the corner to see um, like the before and after and see if I'm missing any spots and I will erase some areas that I feel like I got white on that shouldn't have white so like my hand shouldn't be whitened but that's pretty much it like for the whitening so I will save that to my camera roll and that's done editing it but I will go to this Uno map I think it's called and I've already posted this picture as you can see but I will import it like into the corner and I will see if it matches my feed, which I already posted it, so I'm not going to post it again. But it matches my feed because, like, I whitened it and I whitened all of these pictures, I'm pretty sure. Except for, like, a couple of them because they were already pretty white. But that is it. Um, I use Unum to plan out my feed. I use a VSCO cam to put a filter on it. And I use Facetune to whiten it. And that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and learned a little bit on how I edit my pictures. Like I said, please follow me on Instagram because I actually have gotten 
a lot more into Instagram, if that makes any sense. So if you guys enjoyed this video and you want to stick around for more, subscribe down below. I would really appreciate that. And with that being said, that is it for the video. I hope you guys are having a great day. And I will see you guys in my next video, hopefully. Yeah. Bye, guys.